Before we get back to the action, let's find out more about Spanish sensation Carlotta Seganda, tipped for the very top. I play with Carlotta, you know, I think she's she's the, the talented player, you know, that I think she's she's gonna be unbelievable, you know, so she's probably gonna be, she could be number one, you know. Kind words from a former European number one. There are likely to be many more for Seganda in the future, and we caught up with the youngster after an eye-catching performance in the match play had seen her reach the final round. Hola, my name is Carlotta and I'm 21 years old. I started when I was five years old and I started in a golf course that it's called Ulzama. It's 20 minutes from Pamplona, it's where I live. And I started when we were playing with my dad and, and his friends. I have been playing a lot of amateur tournaments until now and I won all the Spanish tournaments since, since I was 10 until 16, 17 years old. And then I decided to go to the to the States. I went to Arizona State and stayed there for two and a half years. I used to live with my family always, and when I went there, I was just by, by myself. But I, I did great, I made great friends there, and it was a lot of fun. I really like Rafael Nadal, the tennis player. I think he's great, the way he competes and the way he's in the in the courts and then outside. I think he's a great person and great example to follow. He fights until the end and he's always running, hitting every ball and his mentality, I think he's unbelievable. In golf, I really like Sergio Garcia, the Spanish. I'm good friends with him and he's a great golfer. He hasn't been playing good the last two years, but I think from the tee to the green, he's one of the best, best golfers. And then I really like Tiger. I'm lucky because my family never puts pressure on me, so they, they always told me just go, have fun. If you play good, it's great, and if you don't play good, it's great too. I mean, we're going to love you no matter what, so everything is great. I've been playing amateur a lot of years, and I felt that I need uh, more motivation, and I thought it was the right time. I know that it was my first tournament and I'm very thankful to all the media because I know it's good for the player. But at the same time I was in shock because I'm in a lot of yeah, a lot of interviews and a lot of talking and I'm a shy person so it was a little bit hard for me. Expect to see a lot more of Siganda, who surely will rise to be one of the biggest names in the women's game. Hasta luego.